Howdy folks, welcome back to SnowRunner. We are on Rogers Point, picking up where we left off. Um, I think we're going to do cargo container or container delivery part one and part two. Um, one is a two spot container, one is a oversized, so four spot. I've got six spots worth of cargo on the trailer, so let's go get them. You know, there's another job we might knock out while we're down there just because it's really easy, but we'll see. Got to start this thing up, get it turned around, and get it back to... Might be easier to go around this way and cross. Get it back to that warehouse. Um, this one here. I think we can drive right across the swamp and come up this through this little notch here. I'm just going to turn right, see if I can go right through the swamp. And I'll explain that other little job when we get there. Good thing she's got tall snorkels. Is there a pocket right here? Yeah. All good. Ooh, look at that. Underwater. Driving a submarine. I'm just guessing at where I gotta come out, but it looks like I'm on point. To come up right here. I could have probably come straight across that island. But now the trailer is gonna drag, so I don't know if we can... We probably won't need to go back out that way. With an empty trailer, I can drag it over. Now, now that we're here, you see there's a job and a delivery point right in front of us. Let's check that out. Um, sandbags recovery, that's what it is. See, there's three sandbags over here. Packaged sand pallets over here that you could go pick up and bring back over here right next to where we are but let's see if I can nail it uh, maybe not we'll just go back to the truck um, check out what's in this pickup point package sand Start tracking. Job done. <laughs> oh boy. Maybe a little loophole they didn't think of, but you know, whatever, I'm going to exploit it. Alright. Now let's switch to back to cargo delivery container delivery part one. 
We're gonna load up part one and part two. One is a normal cargo container, the other is an oversized. And it's a six spot. Boom, and the trailer sinks in the ass, sinks out of sight. All right, we're loaded. We're loaded down and trucking. <laughs> All right, we have to go up here, and I was thinking like this and over the bridge and around or we could stay on the bottom go through here up there you know that looks more desirable and there's other jobs that could coincide with this but I'm full so, you know, whatever. If we happen to be near a recovery, we could probably drag it along behind the trailer or something. Um, but there's lots of recoveries. Lots of vehicle repairs. There's shit we gotta pick up right here. We're driving right by it, but I get I'm full. So, you know, let's just do this shit and then do what's next. For all the other shit, I could use just a two spot or do nothing but recoveries, you know. All the other shit is one of this, two of that, or a recovery. Let's see, follow that road to the south, swing it around, go across there, and up. Yeah. Can I turn around in here? Uh, God, maybe if I went way the hell down here and around or something. This leads down to a tunnel mouth that doesn't go anywhere. Of course, it does lead down to this road, doesn't it? Yeah! That's my way. If it really does, that looks like a job I never latched on to. New objective discovered. Telehandler work. Oh, that sounds fun. Shuttle some cargo at the factory. This is a work in progress and we won't be able to complete. Okay. Move. Cabin one, move cabin one, move cabin one. You just do the same thing three times and... Okay. I guess I'll have to purchase a telehandler and drive it over here. 
But for now, we're doing what we're doing. There's supposed to be a road down here. Looks like I might be making my own. Ah, oh, there it is. Run all the way across. Oh, yeah. There's our right turn. Once we turn north, then we go east again. I couldn't rem remember. Ever since the dude updated the texture on this map. Some of the trees are white until you get right up to them. Plus there's some... I ran, last time I was on this map I ran into some... invisible barriers I don't know what else to call them it was like there was a uh, it was like there was something there but there wasn't I think I can run right along the shoreline and go up it's e it's an easier deal than uh, climbing the mountain in front of me That's where we get rolled metal. That's the steel factory. Or metal factory, whatever you want to call it. Here's lumber. I left a block cart right in the middle of the road. Should have stopped and deleted it. We don't need to do logs anymore. But, you know, it's inconsequential. It's not even worth the 30 seconds it would take to get rid of it. Now, do I want to go up here? Or stay. I'll climb the hill. I remember last time that, that I went, I followed the valley all the way up. Um, there was a difficult hill at the end.
I probably should have put the big container up front and the small one in the back, but you know, that's the way the ball bounces. This is a uh, free repair, is it? Hmm, okay, I guess it's just a uh, cargo management. Usually when you see that symbol, you can repair your truck, but... Oh well. Finishing our second job. Cool. And now we'll put it on third. Which is uh, not that far away. But getting there could be difficult. I'm thinking... I'm thinking we follow this road. Or maybe we can cross there. I was thinking about crossing down here. Even though it's wide, it's very shallow. But if I could cross here, just come off this corner, go behind the barn, and zip it across, and we're there. Oh, this is the place that has the invisible obstacles. You get stuck on shit everywhere, and, um... I have a job for bricks somewhere in there. Um, this is where you get stuck on invisible shit everywhere. Unless you say stay exactly on the road. Oh, I don't cherish going in there again. Well, we'll give this a try. We'll take this, take this road, and you know, we'll go across this, and then through here, and see what happens. I'm sure I would have gotten that job over there um, since I've been through here before. You don't run the trailer off the edge. You know what? I wonder if I could repack that towards the front. Fuck oh, no. I'd have to move it up to the front and I can't even get to it this crane unless I unhook and park next to the trailer this is why I should have put the big container on first um where the fuck am I going I missed my turn. Well, I guess we'll see if we can go down the bank and get on this one.
and forget all that other shit. And we're here. Make the best of it. On the map, they make it look like a gentle slope. The other side of the bridge might be better, but it's hard to tell until you get there. That looks like a softer slope. I don't want to have to bring a big crane out here to reload this sucker. I'm not even going to go down that until I get the trailer pointed in the right direction. I want the trailer pointed like we're coming from this direction. Then down that little valley or down or straight in front of us. This little thing looks better, except for I don't know what the hell that is. Big mud hole, I suppose. That looks softer than this. You know, sudden drop. Uh, this might be just too hilly. No, that's not what I was looking at. Here we go. Nice gentle slope. All right. And I think now we'll just say screw the waypoints because they're not working correctly. I missed the one by the bridge. I remember having a hell of a time getting into this place last time and then I came back out by crossing the river again. Cross the bridge first. Come on, get up. I was just pushing on the stick too hard. So I made the horn honk. Honk, honk. Anyway, sounded like a, sounded like geese. A goose. If you back up into that grass, you're all done. Even if you try to go straight through here, there's an invisible, like, bump in the road.
Let's uh, deliver this. Yay! Except, what are we gonna do now? I've only been recording 25 minutes. Should I leave my trailer here, do some recoveries? I don't know. At this point, I wish I had uh, like a two spot tow behind. down there where, where we started and it delivers over here two wood planks that wouldn't be hard to get back to I suppose to the construction site which is up there but dang do I gotta really pull a I'm not doing it with a small scout flatbed. So I really got to pull a six spot to do this? <laughs> well, not really. If I pop something out of the garage and just drive it over there and then go up there, I can have it uh, set up with some points beside being able to deliver stuff. I think all these are either <clears throat> recoveries or oh two concrete slabs. That's a four. Where is it telling me? Oh, I see. Place we were just, just near. And then... Ah, down there. Well, shit, look at that. Garage. Here, here. That looks like a good one to do right now. Let's do that shit. But we gotta go back here and shut this off and then go to Z Garage. Grab a shit, I don't know. Buy something. Buy another Kenny. Or. We could do this shit. There it is. That's the only thing you need to change up there. You can change the wheels and you can change the frame add-ons. I go with a stronger crane and a high saddle and now we'll go outside and put an M747 on it see there's though that mark and that will uh, fix your truck
Hopefully that's enough room, looks like. Here's four spot. Low boy. They don't call it an M747 anymore. Oh, but that's what she is. And being the off-road, it's got a little more ground clearance. Now we're going behind us over here to pick up. I think... Do, 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 do. I think like that and up here and over the top and maybe go this way maybe go this way maybe go straight through the trees but somehow see that's really steep right there I'm thinking more like this let's see if the Kras can do that but we gotta go the other way uh, no we just go out to the road and then we go the other way Dang, hole in the way of my turning rays. I think this is where I go up. You betcha. want a little better look at what's in front of me. There's actually tracks here. Tracks over here. Not that I need to follow the tracks. Ah, those go to the bridge. I don't want the bridge. I don't think anyways. Where am I picking up? Right on the other side of this ugly hill. Oh, right down there. How do we do that? See, I didn't uh, follow the low side. I came up on to the high side. We'll get rid of this. this isn't going to do us any good anymore. Try and get rid of that banner. It looks like we can get on, make a U-turn, get on the road straight ahead of us. Let's look ahead of us. <laughs> All right. We'll get in there now. Could be other jobs up here I haven't gotten, but hard to say. I'm not going on all the way around. Of course, I don't think I can go down that either, but I can, uh... Ah, oh, damn. Trailer. I don't know if I can go down that or not. And I don't know where this goes. 
It looks like it comes in from the other side, but I don't want to waste time going all the fucking way around. I'll make a Yui here, and we'll hit this road. There we go. Well, no. That takes us back where we were. Well, we're just gonna have to uh, improvise. Yeah, that's the word for it. Improvise. Hey, we're in cargo management. And we want two slabs. That's it. We're loaded. <laughs> Hanging on the side of a cliff, but we're loaded. Where does it go? Alright, back past the garage. So, right through here. And down to here. Over to here. Over to there. And, uh, get up in here somehow. I think I can make the corner. You betcha. You know why I like the M747. Come on, truck. I think I can go right through this saddle. Maybe. Or over the top. Which works better? This is kind of going the wrong way, ain't it? Let's head for that mark up on top of the hill. Do, do. This featurette brought to you by the Trees Dawn mod. <laughs> the Trees Dawn mod allows me to plow through any forest. The Kraz Chabors allows me to go up and down these steep ass hills anywhere I want. And here we are. See? If there ain't a road where we need it, we just make our own. Oh, that was a tree meant to be in an obstruction. Yeah, I can't do that with this thing. The, uh... <laughs> I need the tall snorkels for this, but I have another plan. If I can latch on to something. I need a... A winch point to frickin' work. No, I need it off the front because I... I can't turn the wheel to steer without... Um, won't work off the front because it's underwater. Oh, hey, here we got something. And let's see. Over there we got something. So now I just get out of that and start pushing on the F key on the keyboard. 
I'm not touching the stick to steer it. Anything like that, so the engine will stay off. And now that it's out, I can disengage the winch and be on my way. Got some cool shit or what? Hmm? Down another hill so we can make a nice turn for the gateway. Oh, there's one of those trees. And in we go. That is uh, number four, but nobody's counting. All right, let's unload two concrete slabs. Point, point, and task completed. All right, that's uh, 42 minutes now. Um, got bringing, well, the job is there, but that, uh, Paystar is over here. I could leave the trailer where it is and run this thing back up the hill we just came down and, uh, Knock that thing out. Um, what was I going to do? I don't even remember. I was going to go around. I'm going to get on the road and go down to where the pay star is. I got to turn by the watchtower and go down here. All right, I'll leave the trailer out there by the road somewhere. I could, shit, I could back up and be on the road, but. Yeah. I knew that would screw up. That the trailer would go the wrong way. That's uh, you know, it's a great trailer, but being so short means it turns very sharply, and it goes exactly the wrong way. I should have just left it at 42 minutes. It would have been easier to get an upload. <laughs> All right, let's see how we get out there. Looks like right here. It says deliver, then repair, I guess. Made that mistake on one other one. I... You know, I could probably turn around. There's enough room here. Could probably turn around. But let's see if I can even hook up. Yeah, she's ready to go. Let's just turn around and go then.
But where are we going? How are we getting out of here? Follow the road back up, go through here. Maybe go outside these big boulders instead of trying to go through the water. Yeah, just go back up to the bridge. Turn around and go back up to the bridge. Truck's somewhere there behind me. Oh shit. I'm right on the money. How about that? And it's got a center point. Center point to center point. I like that. She was a little stuck. But I think that's close enough anyways. Out of fuel. We'll just turn it back off. We'll drag it up there, dead stick. Laying on its side. I don't care. Kraz don't care. Kraz has uh, some points on it. I don't know if it will be enough. I don't know until we get there and fix it if it will be enough points. But should I say irregardless no I shouldn't I should say regardless we're gonna drag it up there anyways yeah it was a little rough there crowds don't care We can just go this side of the pole. Come out right by the garage. If we weren't already at 50 minutes, I'd uh, go in the garage and fix my stuff. My cars. Yeah. We can go from here to there and screw the hills. Just watch her huff and go. I can't even see what I'm about to drive into <laughs> through the smoke. But stage completed. All right. Um, oh, that looks good with the tree coming out of it. Now we have to repair. Five twenty six of eight thirty zero of six zero of one eighty nine. Alright, let's do this. Repair. I've got eight wheels, so we're good there. Let's get it on the right truck. So 
something like that. All right. Boy, she's broke up, ain't she? Now she's good. I got two wheels left. Might even have enough points for myself. Oh, I gotta get the crane off of the bottom. There we go. Crane to international. But back it out again a little bit. Yay! Release winch and accept. And close. And. Well, that's all, folks. I suppose the truck is ours now. Yeah. Oh, I didn't want this in the garage. I wanted the other damn thing in the garage. I didn't switch to it first. I'm... Stupid. That's a rattly thing. All right. There's what we recovered. There's what we did it with. Whatever. Thanks for watching. See you next time.